All right, so I've been through about three thousand dollars in dimes in the last week, uh, two hundred dollars in nickels, and thousand dollars in halves. And I didn't show the video of the fat halves I did last week because they were all brand new. <laughs> it was about ninety percent of ninety-five percent of the rolls were um, like ninety-five or newer coins. There weren't any coins other than that in there, barely at all. I had maybe two or three a roll. So um, both. Both $500 cases. So, I'm going to uh, start looking through these. These all look pretty old. So, hopefully, get better luck this time. Alright, fifth roll in. See, so four wrappers there. This is the fifth one. It's right, chow. Get it out. A. 1969. If I can get it to focus. There you go. It's very cool. It's weird. Anyways. So, 1969 so far. I'll keep looking. Alright, not more than like four rolls later. And I'm going to call it, I'm saying this is a 90 percenter. 64 or 65. Yep, 65. See, every time they're all bright and shit. Anyways, good sign. So that's two out of eight rolls. That's freaking good. I even got, the, that's awesome. I'll let you guys know. Okay, but like three, four rolls later, five rolls later, found another one. This is a smoking case. Absolutely freaking awesome. It's a focus. Focus, you bastard. The light sucks in here right now. There we go, 1966. So, awesome. Got another one. A 1966. So another 40 percenter. So that makes four for the case so far, and that's where I'm at. And I still have the other case. So freaking awesome case. Very next roll. All right. 1965. So two 1965s, 69. 66 and another 66. Five so far, and I've got two thirds of the case left. Alright, found another one. I've still got about a quarter to go. And I actually didn't think it was silver, so I didn't, um, I didn't like, record me opening it. But, uh, because it's, it's real dirty. But, um, it's a 1968. So that makes six so far. And I'm, uh, Still got a quarter to go in that whole case there, so I'm freaking stoked. All right, there's one right here, right on the end. I didn't even see it, or I would have waited till last. I'm kind of mad now, but <laughs> it's a 67. So this one here, we'll put this one up here. 68, 69, 67, 66, 65. So there it is. Seven for the case, and that was only two rolls after the last one, so good god. Oh man, got another one. <laughs> Making up for last week. Good grief. Another 68. So that one goes right chum. Right about there. <laughs> it's almost two of each year. Alright, I still got that much. I haven't even got to the second case yet. <laughs> oh man. Alright. Very next roll. Oh my gosh. <laughs> what is it? Oh, 64. <laughs> oh, freaking A, man. Oh my gosh. I rearrange these 66s. 65, 66. This is 67. Shit. Holy fuck. I can't believe this. <laughs> No, oh, so there it is. Completed the top 64, 265, 266 is a 67, 268, and a 69. I've still got six rolls left of this case. I haven't even got to that case yet. <laughs> oh, I'll let you guys know. Oh, so stoked. Okay, so coin tally so far. Done with the first case. I didn't find anything else. So far, I have a. Get focus. The light in here is off. There you go. A 1969. Two sixty-eights, a sixty-seven, sixty-six or two sixty-sixes rather. Two sixty-fives, 
and a 1964, making that a grand total of nine coins so far, eight 40 percenters, one 90 percenter for the first case. That's the most I have ever found in a case. So I'm going to start on this next case here because uh, I'm flipping out a little bit, and I'll let you guys know what I find. Skunked on the second case, but I still found eight 40 percent silvers and a 90 percent. 1964 so still better than basically every week since the very first week <laughs> that I started looking for silver coins and the halves from uh, that credit union since I started finding them so uh, thanks for watching stay tuned and uh, I'll have another video next Wednesday um, hopefully and uh, remember keep stacking